the average Joe. Hey, you're a stand-up comedian. Tell me a joke. Your first thought is how many different ways you want them to die. Give <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, up to Mr. Danny Menlo. Danny Menlo. Every show before I go on stage, I have a panic attack and think, why the fuck do I do this? Like, what am I doing? And I think of all the bad shows I've had. We're calling the show because it is 45 minutes past the time we uh, said we were going to start, and uh, we don't really have the audience we were looking for. This is Canadian comedy, right? Look. Oh, comedian. Oh, fuck, what the fuck am I doing with my life? Is this something I need to do and get a real job? And then I owe the fucking your friends and family and stuff, and so. I think a lot of people have a misconception that comedians are always just going to be funny yeah. off stage, you know, which is ridiculous to think, but people think that. Nobody who's a comedian wasn't picked on in high school, wasn't poor, had fucking crazy parents. You have to have the world shit on you. Everyone does this as a self-defense mechanism. When you die, you fucking, you just, it destroys everything, you question everything, you want to quit forever. Everyone bombs, but one night, you're gonna go up, you're gonna suck. They're not gonna laugh, they're gonna hate you, but you're gonna know that they were wrong. Danny Menlo! Danny yeah. Menlo, everybody! Yeah. Comedy. <laughs>